Hey, this is Jeff from Green Country Custom Baits. What's up, YouTube? Today, we're doing a product review on MotorMate. Uh, really, the customer service of MotorMate. Uh, this transom saver went on my old G2. So after the intro, we're going to talk about MotorMate as a customer service agency and how they were in this transaction. So don't go anywhere. We'll be right back. Just going to give you a couple of images of my my uh, motor mate for my G2, uh, kind of what's happened to it. First thing you can notice there is we've had a separation of a weld, and we've also got a separation in the welds here. Uh, I, this side is getting close. The first thing started is happening is we started getting some curvature. Uh, in this spine and once we unbox this other product we'll do a comparison and show you what it was originally the paint started chipping off at an early time I wasn't too concerned about that but we started getting curvature in this and so uh, kind of didn't notice it for you know a while and then all of a sudden I started noticing my motor was kind of vibrating as I was going down some of these rough ass highways around here in Oklahoma and uh, uh, went back and actually pulled over it was got to the point to where it was very noticeable in the rearview mirror. Uh, basically, I had to get to the ramp that day, and I stuck it in a campground ground grill and kind of bent it out a little bit just to get myself back home. That night, I emailed MotorMate. How did that transaction go? How long did it take? And so uh, what we're going to do now is we're just going to unbox this, this other one. Let's make sure we got the right product and go from there. There's our new motor mate. It says it's for the Evinrude E-Tech G2. It's a black one, two-stroke motor, 225 to 300 horsepower, and an HO 200 to 250. Well, we got the 250 HO. Okay, so this is the correct one by the box. We get a couple of stickers in the box, which is cool. I like stickers. We get the instructions. But anyway, here's the new one. Uh, let's just do a quick... I'm not sure how well this is going to pick up, but you know, there's the there's the old product and the new product, and the new product uh, is shorter. So they may have updated this since uh, I bought mine basically two years ago. Uh, definitely shorter. If you take that bend out of that new one, I don't know if you guys can see that. Let me put it on this side. You know, just lining up those ends. Look at that. That it's definitely shorter. Okay, look at this was about the slope of the original one. Okay, and as you can tell, we're definitely out of specs there. So there you go. There's the old one and the new one. Uh, but the main thing, again, the main point of this video. Let me get to the damn point. Right? Is motor mate. I emailed Linda or whoever it was. She responded back within a day or two. I think I may have emailed her on a weekend. So uh, it may have been on Monday. And on that Monday, she emailed me back and said, yes, there is a lifetime warranty on that product. What has happened? Send us a picture of your motor mate and what in the areas of, of failure and uh, then in the meantime, once she got that, she would email me back the uh, warranty form for me to fill out and email back to her, and then they would decide what they were going what action they were going to take. And that's exactly how it went. May, it may have been a two or three day process there. Time I got the picture on there, got this done, uh, emailed her back, filled the form out. Uh, I did not have my original receipt. I bought this one at the Bassmaster Classic uh, in Tennessee, I believe. Did not have my original receipt. They didn't even ask. It stated it on that form. I didn't fill it out. I didn't send it in. She got back to me by the next day and said, uh, uh, the company can't determine what has caused the effect, so we are going to warranty your motor mate. We'll send you a new one out within a week. 
will enclose a return label, which there's a return label, and uh, the new one, and make sure you read the directions and know how to install your motor mate. Okay? So, uh, real happy with that. Anytime some company wants to stand behind their product and uh, uh, warranty something, that, you know, mine was only two years old. Okay? I don't know how it'd been if that was 10 years old, but uh, in my experience, uh, Motor Mates a trusted company. They get back with their customers in a timely fashion. Uh, it took uh, three to four days, and the new one's here. So, uh, you know, if you've seen the previous video, I did go ahead and buy a lock and haul. Uh, I want to have a backup. I'm not going to use the, the, the stand that comes with the G2. Yeah, it'll hold it there, but, you know, your motor does this going down the road. I'm not going to have uh, problems with that steering mechanisms and everything else. Just wear and tear on bearings. Uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna have a product so I did go with lock and haul and that's what's currently on there But I will assure you this will go on my boat and this will travel up and down these interstates in Oklahoma Texas, Tennessee all the different Missouri places that I go uh, to go bass fishing and uh, And see if this one's gonna fail does look like there's some changes that they have made to this since I purchased mine I, I, that, that thing is definitely short. So, uh, again, uh, very proud of the company. Thank you very much, MotorMate. Thank you for your good customer support and, and getting me a product in a timely fashion. So, till next time, Green Country Custom Baits, we're uh, signing out, I guess that's what we say. <laughs>